The water rocket is really one of the funnest projects I've done. I'll show you how the launcher is built and then I'll show you how it works. To build the launcher, start with a piece of half inch PVC pipe and file a notch that you can slip an o-ring into. You'll also need to get a one inch coupling and drill it so that you can pass a piece of wire through like this. The last piece that you need to fabricate is a piece of one inch pipe with three equally spaced holes that you can put three bolts into. Then just assemble these pieces like you see here. The end of the half inch pipe should come right up almost to the bottom of the bottle with the o-ring right in the neck of the bottle. Lock the bottle in place with the wire key and then tighten the bolts to secure the entire locking mechanism in place. I decided to mount my launch tower in the simple X configuration platform that you see here. I also hardwired in the valve for my tire inflator so I could connect directly to my air compressor. So here's how it works. At first I was so excited to start launching that I didn't even bother putting fins on the rocket. Still, I was impressed at how high the rockets went without fins. I also found that with just the bottle and no extra weight for fins or anything else, you pretty much get the same effect with or without the water. I went ahead and just cranked my air compressor up to the maximum of about 150 psi. At that pressure, the rockets take off so fast that it's pretty much impossible to film them. However, an empty bottle has almost no mass, and so even though it comes off the launcher incredibly fast, it also slows down very quickly. Without fins, I was only able to get the rockets up as high as maybe 50 feet. I started wondering how much advantage I might gain by adding some fins and maybe some weight in the nose. I had no idea that the fins would help the rocket go at least 10 times as high. All of that really didn't make it any easier to film, so I decided it was time to strap the camcorder onto the rocket. And I finally got a shot that gives you an idea of how high these rockets go. If you look closely, I think you can almost see the curvature of the Earth. Thanks for watching. I appreciate your comments and I hope you'll subscribe to my channel.